go to create and select the front plane go to two point rectangle and make a rectangle here in the midpoint with 50 by 50 millimeters press ok select this line and this line make this construction line go to modify offset select this line and make an offset here minus 10 millimeters and press ok now select the line and close this okay finish a sketch go to extract select this profile extract this 10 millimeters press ok now go to move and copy the object will be body selection select this body and the move type will be rotate show the origin and select the axis the green axis okay rotate this minus 90 degrees and create a copy press ok now go to move and copy again select this the body tool the axis will be the blue axis rotate this 90 degrees don't create a copy okay press ok now go to move and copy again select the body tool select the, the axis the blue axis rotate this 90 degrees create a copy and press ok now one more time move and copy select the body tree rotate the axis will be the red the red axis rotate this 90 degrees and press ok now go to sketch one modify the sketch one go to edit sketch click in the midpoint delete this constraint click in the midpoint again let the constraints now we can move the sketch look okay what we will do uh, go to coincident select this line and this line make this coincident now go to sketch dimension select this line in the midpoint this distance will be 10 millimeters press ok and finish the sketch we will have something like that see that here is the same line and here is the same line okay hide the origin go to create a sketch and select this face go to two point rectangle click in the midpoint and make a rectangle here a square 10 by 10 press ok now select line and make a line here the, this line will be a construction line the distance of this line in the midpoint is 30 millimeters okay finish a sketch we will have something like that and go to revolve the profile will be the square and the axis will be this line the construction line the angle will be 90 degrees and the operation will be joined press ok now let's make the same thing but in the other face go to create a sketch select this face go to two point rectangle click in the midpoint make a square here 10 by 10 okay select the line make a line here this is a construction line then go to sketch dimension the distance between the line and the midpoint is 30 millimeters press ok finish a sketch go to revolve 
the profile will be the square and the axis will be the construction line. The standard type partial angle 90 degrees and operation join. Press OK. Now let's make another one. Go to create a sketch, select this face, go to two point rectangle. Click in the midpoint, make a square here, 10 by 10. Press OK. Select line. Make a line here. It's a construction line. The distance between the line and the midpoint is 30 millimeters. Press OK. Finish the sketch. Go to Revolve. The profile will be the square and the axis will be the construction line. Extent type partial, angle 90 degrees, and operation join. Press OK. Now go to move and copy. The move object will be body. The selection will be this body. And rotate, click in rotate, show the origin. The axis will be the green, green one axis. Rotate this 45, millim 45 degrees and press OK. Hide the origin. Okay. We will have something like that. Now, go to create and select the top line. Go to create and project include and project. Select this edge and press OK. Now, go to circle and make a circle here in the middle of this line with 2.5 millimeters. Okay. I'll go to extrude, select the, the profile, it will be this circle, and the distance, the start will be offset, offset minus 80 millimeters, and the distance will be 20 millimeters, okay? The operation will be join, press OK. You have something like that. Now go to create a sketch again. Select this face. Make a circle here with the same midpoint, okay? With 50 millimeters of diameter, okay? And finish the sketch. Go to solid, extrude. The profile will be this. Don't forget to select this circle, okay? Extrude this two millimeters and press OK. The operation will be joined, okay? Don't forget. Okay. Now go to fillet and select the Z it will be 1.5. Fillet here, press OK. Go to fillet and select the Z. The fillet here will be 15 millimeters. Press OK. Now go to fillet again. Select fillet and select this edge. This. This. Let's rotate the, the body. Select this edge, this edge, and this edge. This fillet will be 10 millimeters. Press OK. Go to fill it again. Select this edge, this edge, and this edge. Rotate this again. Select this edge, this edge, this edge. The fill it here will be 20 millimeters. Press OK. You have something like that. 
like this okay we have something like this now to finish this exercise go to modify and select shopper select this at this just select the same ads that I'm selecting the fillet the chamfer here will be one millimeters and press OK. Here we finish the exercise 74. I hope you enjoyed it. So thanks for watching and bye bye. Subscribe my channel, don't forget man. Bye bye.